What's going down, people? YouTube, you've got your boy Single Tap here, and uh, there's a problem in the last episode of my walkthrough. It kind of got deleted because the audio got deleted, and um, that means there's no commentary on it. I didn't want to post it without commentary, so I'm not going to be able to post that. It, but all it was was me talking to someone and going up to a mission, and now we're actually in the mission. The mission was come fly with me, and you talk to the guy that's in the dinosaur from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. in Novak City. And once you talk to him, he'll give you the mission. You go up, and you're going to get rid of some ghouls from a facility. Uh, that's where I, I am now. I'm talking to the ghouls to let you guys know. I'm sorry that happened. I really wanted to make this walkthrough good, but I can't I can't really go back and find lost audio, if you know what I'm saying. So um, hopefully you still enjoy. We're going to start the video. I'm going to see if I can cut some time out to fit this in. And, uh, yeah, if I don't know. I can't do much about it. Thanks for being subscribed. Thanks for watching my videos. Uh, let's go on with the video here. What's going down, people of YouTube? You've got your boy Single Tap here again. Uh, this is continuing off the last episode where we uh, we started this mission. Um, what's the mission called? Let's go check that out. I think it's like something about flying, which is pretty sweet. I want to fly. Come fly with me. We started the Come Fly With Me mission. I want to finish it now. If you missed that episode, uh, I'll go ahead and add an uh, annotation in the top left corner. You can click on now. It's right there. So uh, go ahead and click on that if you missed the last episode. And if not, I'm happy uh, Happy you're joining in for two episodes in a row. It's like half an hour. Um, usually when I listen to people commentate over a game, I'm usually playing the game at the same time. I'm not really watching all that much just because... Um, I like to hear a voice if I'm not talking to a friend already, and uh, I like to hear a voice talking about the the topic that I'm uh, in, invested in at the moment. So I, I'm watching Fallout New Vegas commentary as well. Look at all these dead bodies! I own these guys. Here's a nightkin. I always take these guys' clubs because you can put them to get all together, repair them all, and then you can sell them for a pretty lot of a uh, pretty large amount of money. And now we're going to go down in the basement where there's a lot of these guys and they're invisible and they're very hard if you don't fight them right. Um, if you're do doing melee with them, you're bound to have a hard time. Luckily, I'm cool enough that I have guns. I don't have to do that. But I am. I recommend you stay crouched and every time you see one, press the right bumper. Uh, that way it will... Or not even see one. Just... I, I consistently press the right bumper that way it targets them for me and you don't actually have to try looking for them um, because that see uh, well he's not actually invisible that's actually a really bad example let me use my sniper rifle um so let's truck this guy really badly <laughs> I think you guys know know what I'm gonna do here. This is the Rat Slayer. We got about two episodes ago. Whoa! I didn't expect you to come that fast. Didn't even do damage to him. Dang. Scared me, buddy. Man, see, these guys are really tough. That's what I'm talking about. You guys have to be a little bit smarter than me. Because that wasn't smart at all. Oh, uh, no ammo for the cowboy repeater. I'm gonna use the nine millimeter here just to keep backing up and shooting. There we go. And I know someone posted a comment saying I can get rid of those slow motion things in the option. But I haven't bothered to do that yet. I'll probably do that uh, once I finish this mission. I'll go ahead and do that. Let's make sure there's nothing I want in here. This part is pretty difficult, so... Whoa, 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 whoa. See, these guys are everywhere. I'm gonna need to take a stim pack. Luckily, I have my EDE, and he's doing a little damage to him. I don't know what turbo is, but I'm gonna use it, because if it helps, I need it. I'm also going to use Steady. I need to use a bunch of stuff to help me get through this whole area. And... Did I need health? No, I'm good with health. And let's just do a bunch of shots to the head here. 
That way I can get them really weak. Oh, all the shots missed because something got in the way. The liches are not fun. Whoa, it seems like it just went slow motion for a second there. Oh, that probably had to do with turbo. Too bad I turned it off. You have to kind of dodge his uh, hammer. It's really not that hard. But it's, uh, it's definitely not that easy. Yeah, there we go. Critical strike. That's exactly what I needed. And they all have south boys, so if you are really having a hard time, you know, you can just activate that south boy and none of them will ever see you. Makes it a lot easier. And there's also beds out here. But you have to get rid of the enemies surrounding them to uh, sleep in them. I usually will sleep in them for like an hour to get a little bit of a little bit of health. Um, whoa, these guys are really on top of their game right now. Hopefully these all hit him. Yeah. Yeah, get distracted by EDE. No, the EDE's right over there. Yeah, EDE on him. <laughs> he doesn't know what to do when there's an EDE and a guy shooting at him. He's like, I don't know what to do. Oh, are you kidding me? They always survive by the littlest. What? No way. There's no way I'm fighting both of them. Good thing I picked up those grenades earlier. Because we're going to be using them now this is definitely gonna go on to three episodes <laughs> let's use psycho where the hell are my grenades oh i'm looking in the wrong section dummy frag grenade and I need, i'm gonna need frag grenades all right nope not when you're that close that's not happening bam ow I don't even think it hurt that one. 9 millimeter, and the rest will be AP, and that should take them out. Yeah, that'll take them out. What? <laughs> That's doing no damage to him. It's ridiculous. Alright. I'm getting lucky, lucky with these crit strikes here. Give me your club. I'm happy they're all charging me, actually, because then I can take them all out now, and I don't have to go search around. Holy crap, EDE scared me. Right here, there's gonna be one, I think. Yeah, this is the boss. Uh, no, actually, it's, it is a boss, but it's not the boss boss. See, this guy's gonna be tough here. Let's use some aid. Mm, what do I need? Damage resistance. Let's take a water. And stim pack, stim pack. And do we have anything to help my gun? Mm -mm. Nope. Okay, we're gonna use fixers so I'm not addicted to a drug. All right, we're good. So let's be. Let's hopefully kill this guy. Whoa, this guy's really intense. Ooh, wow, that's domination right there he put his face in my gun and just let me finish him and he gave me an incinerator and I'm not gonna take his club cuz I don't want it he doesn't uh, deserve me to take his club now let's go down to this jail place because if we go down to the jail place we can complete a quest right now uh, that you they're gonna ask you to do later Ah, man, I hate it when drugs and crap run out because then you have to deal with that fuzziness. So just come over here and look at this dead body. And once you do, you can leave it. I'm at eight minutes, so I should be able to get ooh, the rest of this underground part done. Pretty much what I want to do. And then in the last part, we'll finish the whole quest. As I said, this is a long quest. Um, luckily, I have the ability to post all these videos in one day. So you guys don't have to wait three days for this one quest. That'd be kind of annoying. Like, you're watching one part of a quest. What? And, um... Yeah, you're watching one part of a quest. Oh, okay, we have to go in here. You're watching... <laughs> I keep saying this. 
you're watching one part of a quest and um the next part isn't up that'd be kind of weird all right whatever that's all i want we have to go on my mini map so i can figure out where to go in here all right it should be right down this hallway and to the right and soon we're gonna fight the boss of all bosses that's in here which is right over here fixer has wore off I wanna see the conditions we're under right now mm -hmm. alright as long as we're not losing anything that's all I care care about and that's the last guy you're gonna have to kill if I can get a hidden strike on him that would help so much you know what I'm just gonna use frag grenades to start it up it's so kind of a waste no I can kill him with my incinerator screw it Hopefully I can kill him with my incinerator. This guy's kind of getting stuck. Which is good. He's really tough. He has a very powerful weapon. And he's very fast. As you can see. Uh, 9 millimeter. Take his face off. Take his face off. I said take his face off. Don't just shoot it a little bit. Uh, I keep having to go back in here and activate stuff, but I don't want to die, you know? I'd rather stay on the safe side. Come on, you can take his face off. How am I on fire? <laughs> I like how I just reload, like, so calmly while someone's trying to machete me. And that's the final guy. And you definitely want his sword. It's worth 940 caps. Good deal. Right there. And let's heal my character right quick. Okay, we're good. That's the final night, kid. So let's go talk to this guy, and then we can get out of here. Come and get it, you big no, I'm not a big dumb guy. Come on. This guy is... He's cool. I like him, cause basically, um, guess the outfit gives them yeah, he says life. it right here. I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the. He just on. leaves them, and he's like, "Yeah, I'm just gonna go down in the basement and kill all those nightkins, those demons, as you guys said, you retards." Oh, is he shooting me? I was about to say, I want to be cool. Who is shooting me? Oh, jeez, why is he shooting me? That's that's what I get when I don't look at my options. So I'm gonna have to go kill him. But that's alright. I'm a killer. I'm a killer at heart. Uh, what gun? Rat Slayer. It'll do very nicely against someone who's shooting me with a sniper rifle. He doesn't even know where I am. Oh, now he does. Jeez. Where are you? It's so hard to aim my shot with this sometimes. Just took him out without taking any damage at the end there. So, um, I guess if you just speed through the options like I did, he's going to start killing you. But you can get him to chill. Uh, you can go around here, yeah. And if you go over here where he is, you can take all of his crap. And he has a lot of stuff, so. What's this do? Barter plus five, I'll take it. And he has some ammo, so I recommend you take all of his ammo. And you can get out of here. That's the end of that. Ooh, and he has bear traps. Watch out for them. That's the end of that. So we're going to leave this basement, and that'll end. Uh, that'll conclude this, uh, the second part of this, and the third part will finish up the quest. I know this commentary might not have been the most entertaining. I can't imagine it was, but I'm trying to make it. I'm trying to make lemons out of lemonade, if you know what I'm saying. It's pretty hard to do commentary over a quest like this because it's just like you go to a place and then everyone's like I'll oh, go downstairs and kill random people and then yeah it doesn't really build character or anything and it's not all that interesting uh, in my opinion but it's still a fun quest you still get a worthy amount of experience from it and I am lost right now how the hell do I get over there Oh. I figured it out. It's all good. 
All right, so we finished the basement, and uh, in the third part, we'll finish the quest. And then, what are we doing after this? I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get Boone, who is a mercenary, who's the most powerful mercenary, uh, in my opinion. And then uh, we'll finish it. So again, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. That helps so much. Uh, if you have anything to say, anything to say, leave a comment. And 